Today, you will learn how to decompose two-dimensional shapes into other geometric shapes. You will also learn how to identify the resultant geometric parts. Let's start with a rectangle. Could we decompose it into a square and another geometric shape? Sure, let's try. The resultant geometric parts would be a square and a hexagon. Why is the other shape a hexagon? Well, let's count the sides. One, two, three, four, five, six. It has six sides. Therefore, it is a hexagon. Now, let's go back to our original rectangle. We can cut it in half horizontally. The resultant geometric parts would be two smaller rectangles. Let's think of another way we can decompose our original rectangle. We can cut it diagonally as shown in this model. The resultant geometric parts would be two identical triangles. Let's explore a little further. This time, let's decompose a triangle. If we cut a triangle in half, the resultant geometric parts would be two identical triangles. What other shapes can you decompose? How many different ways can you decompose each one of those shapes?